Well, that was quite a performance by Stevenson's Mustangs tonight. 11-7 was the win over Rowan. They were shorthanded tonight. Joining us now is head coach Kathy Raley. And coach, we talked about this before the game, and you were a little mm -hmm. concerned because you were shorthanded. What a performance tonight. You know, what a team effort from top to bottom. You know, when, when we were talking about who to bring up here to, to do the post-game interview mm -hmm. as an as a individual players, I mean, we, we, we couldn't decide. The coach, we sat outside as coaches for like five minutes trying to think who – who can you bring up when everyone had such an amazing performance and played their hearts out and played so tough and so physical and really matched all the things that we as a staff were worried or whether or not we could handle. And not only do we handle it, we outperformed in that environment. So l let's take us through it because, you know, you guys started 0-3. Mm -hmm. You're 6-1 since, 6 out of 7. <laughs> What's happening with this team right now? Well, there's a couple things. I think that we uh, first really put, uh, put our attention on goal scoring. And so we started to score more, more and more goals. So what that does is then in practice, your defense naturally gets a whole lot better because they're, they're having to practice every day against a much more goal-seeking team. I think the biggest thing, though, is we now have a situation where we have a goalie we can trust. Mm, totally. Um, it's so much easier to play a fluid defense and, a, and an aggressive defense uh, when you know that your goalie is going to make the saves if you deliver an out-of-angle shot or an under-pressure shot. And, boy, I thought, well, you know, Reagan made the saves that she was supposed to make today. Um, you know, the ones that went in – you know, they, were, they should go in. They're a good shooting team, and we didn't have the right pressure on or didn't have the right angle uh, you know, where we were on the, on the shooter herself. So, but, but that is just such an important part of it. Um, I was so happy that we outshot them as many as we did. I thought that was By just a, oh, so, so good. And uh, one of our goals was to have a, a better third quarter, and oh. we, we well, had that's a good the, third that's quarter. That's the difference in the game right there. What did you say at the half? What was the difference not in the Not much. Third? So obviously I'm not allowed to say much <laughs> anymore. I wanted two things to happen. I, I went into today, and I think we talked about this. I went into today's game that I was not going to overwhelm with information at halftime because mm. I thought that might have been one of the problems with our third quarters. So I came in with two pieces of information, um, handed the coaches three things each to talk about, uh, and I think that was helpful. I think, you know, hearing from those th the three different voices instead of just mine in a dominating way was probably a calming effect on them. And, uh, and I gave them a lot of time to pump each other up, which I think might be uh, mm. the real part of that. Yeah. Well, just do it for each other. It mm -hmm. doesn't have to be, you know, it's not about the X's and O's every minute of every game. It's gotcha. often about heart and grit and, and tenacity and, and um, the X's and O's are part of it, but it's not the whole picture. Hmm. Yeah. So a couple of notes from the game. Sophia Murray had a great game, as oh, usual, four goals, mm -hmm. but both ends of the field. But I noticed, though, that Ava Trakel may have taken, like, all the draws tonight. I'm not 100% sure. Was that because you were a little shorthanded coming to the game, or what was the uh, – There were some other issues that we were that we were having, and it was just the right decision for today. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. It was the right decision for today, and, and it's not always going to be that way. And, mm -hmm. and um, you know, we have a lot of people that can take the draws. Um, but we uh, we this is what we went with today, and it, you know got us the win, so we're happy with it. So you, so your goalkeeper Reagan Torbert, we're going to yes. talk to her in a moment, as well as Carrie Russo. But the but the back line in front of Reagan Torbert today, I know you were a little concerned, but they came up big time today. So I, I think we've zeroed in on a couple defenses that really work well for us. So what I think we were able to do today was just take Rowan out of a flow. Mm. They were taking third. You know, we had I don't know how many uh, times that we were able to get a possession clock violation mm -hmm. on them because we, they were taking 30, 35 seconds, 40 seconds to figure out what on earth defense are they playing so that they could make their play calling. So they'd come down with a man offense, but we weren't in a man. So they would, by the time they figured it out, they were out of time to execute their man offense. If we can continue, and that was the goal, uh, you know, the team in the beginning of the season, they were, you know, not happy. I was changing defenses all the time. Change defense, mm -hmm. change defense, change defense. And I, I, I promised them that they would pay off. And uh, I really felt like today we were able to throw this defense and then throw that defense and then throw this defense. And it kept, kept uh, you know, a really good team to a low uh, goal total. They delivered mm -hmm. tonight, no yeah. question. And Mary Washington the other night, nine yes. goals as well. Yeah. We're, we're going to let you go. Yes. Congratulations Thank on the you. win. Saturday we'll be back, Eastern, to Wonderful. start a MAC play. And Senior Day. And, and Senior Day. And Senior yes. Day. Yes.